So there's a number of ways to crop an image in GIMP. Um, so I'll just show you the ways that I most commonly use. So the first one is um, I actually, I'll take a screen cap of my desktop just by using the print screen button or something, but I actually only want a specific area. So all you have to do is grab your selection tool up here, rectangle select tool, and just draw around the area you want. So that's the only area I want. Now once you let go, you can adjust the corners like that. And then you can just go image and crop to selection. And now that I've got that there, I can just go edit copy. And I can start a new email like this and then just paste it into the email and there it is. So that's one way to crop. So I'll just undo that and show you another way. Um, perhaps you've got a larger photo that you've taken with your camera or your phone um, and it's wide enough but um, you need it to be um, not as tall so what you do is you'd go image canvas size and say so here it says uh, 1920 by 1053 which isn't actually HD resolution, but just as an example, I'm going to go, I want it to be 1920 by 500. And we can see down here, we can preview and move it up and down to where we want it to be cropped. So I'm going to say I want it to be there. And then we just go resize. And now it takes out that top and bottom and we've only got this area here. Now there's another very cool crop tool that I use all the time. If you're putting an image on a website, you don't actually want all of this white space around it. So what you can do is you can go image, crop to content, and it automatically cuts out all of that white or the consistent color that's around the outside. So that's three different ways you can crop. There's actually other ways too, but I'm sure you'll find those in your own time.